The Daily Fill is back in Japan for a big food trip in Tokyo. If food and travel is your passion, then this channel is perfect for you. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button and notification bell to get your regular dose of the Daily Fill. The park tomorrow morning. So we are right here at Oreryu Shio Ramen in their main branch right here in Shibuya. We ordered their best seller, which is the garlic butter fried chicken ramen. This is not your typical or traditional ramen. It's like East meets West. So you have shio ramen, salt-based soup, and of course the noodles. Char shu. We top it with three huge chunks of uh, karaage. And then they put mozzarella cheese and parmesan cheese, which makes the broth really, really rich and much, much more flavorful. The noodles were really, really good. I had the caramel texture. The soup, it's really rich. It's a little bit lighter than tonkotsu, but because of the parmesan and the mozzarella cheese, it becomes so much more flavorful. It has a kick to it as well. There's a little bit of spice in there. There were lots of roast garlic at the bottom of the bowl. We also put butter from uh, Hokkaido or Sapporo, I think, and that made the soup really, really rich. I must say that I really love it. For 1,000 uh, yen, or around 500 pesos, it's worth every yen because it has a lot of regions. It actually has everything. Uh, however, the major masasuya kaya is a cheese. But so good. I still love it. namin kumain ng garlic butter fried chicken ramen dito sa Oreryu Shio Ramen. Napakasarap. It was a big serving. It had parmesan cheese and mozzarella cheese. Kaya naman napaka salty, napaka rich, at napaka flavorful ng soup. It's a good start to our Tokyo food. What is oh, it's like... Good morning everybody. We're still continuing with our Tokyo food trip. We are now right here on our second stop. Supposedly they're gonna offer us something big in value. We are right here at Taiko Chaya. We enjoy kami ng unlimited sashimi dito. The restaurant opens at 11. Kailangan yung agahan kasi kukuha kayo ng ticket for reservation. Then you only have 50 minutes to dine. So there we're gonna enjoy unlimited sashimi. Ngayon medyo mahaba na yung pila. Hindi, ayun na nga. Nandito na kami sa aming second stop. Ay, Kochaya. Unlimited sashimi. Unlimited tuna. Unlimited bonito. Unlimited salmon. Unlimited heavy and maraming marami pang ibang seafood like scallops, limited rice, limited salad, limited miso soup. They even have dessert. Ang kanilang mga seafood nire refill regularly, so hindi nyo kailangan magmadale, hindi kayo mauubusan. However, there is a time limit of 50 minutes. And you can have unlimited sashimi for oh, 1,500 yen, so that's more or less 700 pesos. So, kung mahilig kayo sa seafood, sulit na sulit talaga ito para sa inyo.
experience like a chaya. Sashimi is really my favorite. Everything is really fresh. Everything is really tasty and delicious. My favorite would have to be the bonito and the ebi. My favorite would be the shrimp, henna, and the bonito. Right? So if you're a fan of uh, raw, raw seafood, I think this is the best place to eat. So, good job, Taiko Chaya. on a bed of rice smothered with Japanese curry and then I think it comes with eggs and a couple of sausages for 1,100 yen. We just wanted to order world champion curry. It's a big one, but we just wanted to eat it. We didn't want to eat it. We're here in the Bueno Branch. It's a big one. This is where the tourists and the local go for the shopping. So we're just waiting for our order. Conquering the world one country at a time using a Filipino passport. Until next time, travel now, Bill Slater. What can you say about the experience? Sobrang worth it. Sulit na sulit ba? Sulit na sulit. Kasi yung mga nakadalawang kilong isda ako tsaka isang kilong hipon. So mga magkano rin yun sa Pilipinas. 